Tom. Hello, everybody. Tom Fox here. Welcome back to Monster Rancher th 2. Not 3. Monster Rancher 2 back at the ranch. Uh, and last time, we've just finished up the Winner's Cup, which is the first of the Major 4 tournament. I'm surprised we made it this far. Anyway. Uh, let's see. This episode, we're going to be doing a little bit of training and getting into the I'm a Fimba meet. So let's start off by giving him, not a mint leaf. Did I already give him an item? Keep going, you two. The hard part is just beginning. What am I going to do? I'm going to buy myself some nuts. I require two anyway, so I'm going to buy two. Okay, I didn't give him anything yet, so that's good. Training. Let's see. I'll do the leap, because that'll give my give my monster uh, a good amount of speed, but it'll also uh, improve intelligence over the threshold where it will get to 900. Or, yeah, 900. Or he'll fail it like a bitch. Seems disappointed. Womp womp. He's not stressed out, is he? The meat is here. Let's get do it, Whisk Kitty. Huh? Hey, what's the doll doing out here? Did you move it? The what the? No, I didn't move it. How about you, Joy? Quack quack. That's strange. Well, anyway, don't ever don't move it ever again. Whisk Kitty as well. The doll. It moves upon its own. Alright. Did I use the nuts? I use the nuts. Such a short term memory I have. Let's do it! The I'm a Fimba Meat Rank S. Let's do our best and try to be victorious. Why does the toucan quack? Japanese. Here we are at another two continent meet. The representatives of Aima and Fimba will get into a hot, hot fight. Zodiac star sign. Donated five dollars. Said I was going to put something witty here, but nothing comes to mind. Anyways, your streams are awesome. Keep up. Thank you. The Aima Fimba meet. I'm so nervous. It's our first time to be a representative. We gotta win. Let's get a victory. What the? Now we will announce the battle schedule for the I'm a Fimba meet. All right. We are up against Hamid, which appears to be a hare and a plant. It's either a plant or a zoom. The mentioned five matches will be held now. Good luck, everyone, and do your best to honor your association. Wait, what the? She's... Bingo! Bingo! The Zavik, thank you for the second Twitch baby. Keep enjoying those tinted glasses and emotes. Here's a sub for your sub. Mwah. Are you Miss Holly? Yes. Cool. I'm your fan. Oh, uh, um, may I ask, may I, uh, ask to have your autograph? Here? Sh sure. Here. Thank you very much. You are the most popular woman trainer. I could show off your autograph to my friend. So you, you're also aiming to be a trainer? Yes, my name is Colt. I want to become like, I want to become like you. I, I know the path is tough, but, uh, but, ha uh, but hang in there. Don't get defeated. Looking forward to seeing you in the tournament. Yes. Fun fact. Um, Monster Rancher 1 and 2 run parallel to each other. Holly is actually the trainer assistant in Monster Rancher 1. What the? I'm so glad I'm able to enter this tournament. Let's get going. We will now begin the I am a Fimba meet. Milliam versus Mopetto. Milliam takes it. The winner of the last battle was Milliam. All right. Huawei versus Gorgon. Oh, I, I wasn't expecting go. Wait a minute. Oh my God. I've been playing some of the, the uh, Monster Rancher one a little bit. I recognize these names. These are all names of monsters in Monster Rancher 1 that you fight in, uh, in tournaments. The winner of the last battle was Gorgon! We lost the battle. Come on, Aspen! Aspen! Oh, we're counting on Siva now. The winner of the last battle was Quan. 
Does Cold Pierre Monster Rancher 1? No, no, she does not. Yes! Oh my god, now all we have to do is win ours and we got this. The last, the winner of the last battle was Siva! All right! We're going to fight with Holly. Go easy on us, Colton, what the? We're going to win, right? What the? Oh, we're planning on winning too. See you guys at the battle. Say, what the? Do you want to give Whiskitty advice during the battle? Yes. Bring it home. It's up to me. Oh dear. Oh my god! Knocked a lot of my guts off of me there. And I don't deal that much damage to it at all. This does not look good. And I'm dead. <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, man. S-rank Fimba matches are the hardest things in this game. The battle uh, of the last battle was Hamid! Oh, we lost. Well, let's work harder to win next time. Now the tournament is over. Allow me to announce the results. This year's winner is... FIMBA TEAM! This year's winner is FIMBA! A bit sad for Aima. They are already looking for, uh, for the next year tournament. Man, you had a 20% chance to hit me there, too. Sorry, guys. We won this time. Alright, we lost this time. But we'll win next time, right? What the... See you next time. See you next time! I might bring Whisk Kitty back for that. I got boned in that one. Good lord. Here's hoping Whisk Kitty ain't dead. What the? I think Whisk Kitty is injured. It's not serious, but I'll put it in the hospital for a fast recovery. He got injured during that match. Was Kitty still in the hospital? Well, we mi- uh... Oh no, I don't think- uh, I don't think we missed the, uh, the next tournament. Dang. You doing alright there, Whisk Kitty? I think- I don't think he's tired, but I'll, I'm gonna buy him a nuts oil and give it to him just in case. He's fine. Yeah, Whisk Kitty got obliterated. We're not gonna let that happen again, though. Speed training from here on out! Whisk Kitty doesn't look very good these days. Maybe we should consider retiring it. Oh boy. Yes, who is it? Hi, Cole. Thank you for what. Thank you for the other day. You too, love that. Thank you for your work at the meet. You're welcome. What brought you here today? Well, uh, we had a meeting with Fimba the other day, and Fimba agreed to let us learn techniques about how to raise four of their monsters. Really? Only the trainers who participated in those the, the meet can learn those, though. Say what the? I'll arrange for you to raise those four monsters. Worm. Henger, Gally, Mew. When you find those monsters, try your best to raise them. I'm leaving now. Thank you. Well, what the? I wonder what those monsters look like. We just got a picture of them! Yeah, Whisk Kitty's on his way to retire, on his way to, uh, to death here. I don't think I missed the next tournament. Maybe I haven't even been invited to it yet. It's every three months one of these tournaments happens. I think we get the invite in October and we get to participate in November. I, I blame translation. Yeah, Muse under the truck. 
Am I gonna try for the Beaklon challenge now that I have Worm? Uh, I'm gonna use Worm to try and make a, uh, an adventure monster. You know what I might do? I might max out his stats and then put him in, in stasis until I can, uh, until he can do the, uh, the tournaments I need him to do. Uh, let's have him do... I'll have him do the dodge. If I get his speed up, then it'll be very unlikely that anything will actually be able to hit him. Boom! Success! Official tournament's happening this week. He's already at max rank. And before he dies tomorrow, don't even joke about that. There, there'll be a point where, where uh, Colt will say something where it's pretty much just like, guess what, your monster's gonna die tomorrow. Like, that that's pretty much what we'll, what we'll end up finding out on this. Gonna keep doing the leap. I'm gonna keep doing leap and dodge until he's maxed out at speed, and then I'll work on intelligence and uh, skill. His ma yes, his max lifespan is 10 years by default, but stress has plays a factor in that. Plays a big factor in that, to be honest. What do I want to give him this month? I'm gonna give him fish. Fimba's S monster was, uh, wasn't necessarily OP, yet, but it's like, Hello, young lady. I'm back again. <laughs> All right, let me make sure I actually say no. There we go. I will go with him one of these days. In fact, I might, uh, I might freeze, uh, Whisk Kitty and then get a, uh, Golden Peach. Did say he was well or seemed well? I think it said he was well. I can give him the golden peach to extend his lifespan by a year. Let's do the dodge! Boom! Success! Look at that strut. Yes, who is it? Is it the what does Ah, here we go. There's the invite to the tournament. Second week of November. This is the second week of October. Okay, so they're announced two months beforehand. Meaning that on the first week of... Let's see. It's November, so that means December. On the first week of January, I'd have to bring him back out. Uh, let's see. Going with the nuts oil. Can't only give one peach, a uh, golden peach per monster? Yes. What I wanted to do was keep him in stasis, give him a golden peach, that way he'll live longer, and then I'd be able to beat the, 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 the rest of the major four. Uh, let me see. Oh, no, it's one month in advance. Okay. So November. Yeah, so it's three. Okay, so one, two. So, G yeah, second week of January, or first week of January, I gotta... Drill. He's getting pretty close to the grave, though, I have to admit. Let's do the leap. Parkour kitty. He's a parkour kitty. It doesn't work as well as parkour puppy because it's not alliteration. He's intelligent. He'll call 911 if anything is wrong. I'm gonna try to reduce his stress as much as possible. He was very stressed throughout a lot of his life, though, so. Good night, son.
Boom! Success! Whisk Kitty seems well. I'm waiting for a uh, for a sale to buy um, mint leaves in bulk, which is why I'm constantly going back to the store. What if I gave a gold peach to a Sueki Suezo and see how far I can go with it? That wouldn't be a bad idea. One year to train up a Sueki Suezo. I'd have to see what its what its uh, growths are. Did I do dodge or leap last time. I think I did dodge. Boop, boop. All that mercury in the fish is catching up to Whisk Kitty. Oh dear. I'm not gonna scold him because that adds stress to him. Anything I can do to de-stress him is gonna be like what I what I have to do here. I'm probably gonna have him rest before this tournament as well. How do you know your monster's gonna die? Um He's kind of knocking on death's door a little bit here because of the... You've got mail. Probably errant tree. Uh... He's probably knocking on death's door. Like, he's probably, like, maybe a year outside of death because Colt just said that, uh... To consider retiring him. Whisk Kitty seems tired. Uh-oh. If he's, like, about to die, usually, like, one day before death, uh, Colt will say something. Rest. Then I'll give him the mint leaf I just bought, and then he'll enter the tournament. This kitty is very well. That's good. He's so close. He's so close to, to beating the uh, the major four. And if he dies, I'm gonna have to start this whole cycle over again. Whiskey's gonna die throwing tornadoes and monsters. I didn't save either. The most OP monster yet. Not as OP as that hair we faced. Who farted into my face when we first met. The ocean swimming season is about to end here at the Torval Arena. Under the circumstance, World Monsters Cup is now beginning. What the? Let's go for it. We got Zelandia, which is a ghost dragon, Dugard, which is a gel uh, Zilla, and Sierra, which is a dragon uh, pixie. That fart wasn't OP, though. That fart didn't do a lot of damage to me at all. I was hoping a lot of his other attacks would miss, but they didn't. This thing is a pushover. Man, I'm just putting out some pretty weak monsters by comparison here. Uh, excuse me. Oh, I didn't want to use Thrust Claw! The weakest of all claws! The longer I prolong- the more I prolong this battle, the more likely Whiskitty's gonna die in this fight. I'd rather get in range of his fire breath, please! There we go. Yeah, Whisk Kitty's got a lot of skill. It would take something with a really high amount of uh, of speed to dodge Whisk Kitty. Drewguard should be pretty easy, because Zillas are mainly known for just their power and HP. I'm a little bit worried about Ciara. How do you get the Bone Dragon? I don't remember what it's a combination of. I think it's a Dragon and Reaper. Yeah, so this thing's not going to be hitting me at all, and if it, but if it does, it'll be devastating. Roll Assaults, 1%. Earthquake, Scratch is 3%. Belly Attack. He's gonna knock me up? No, he's gonna keep trying to scratch me. 
Don't give me that cat scratch fever. I said, don't give me that. Don't knock me up. I want to get to 99 before I start attacking. Or I could crit him and I wouldn't even have to, to have done that. I did one damage. <laughs> Take that, whale! Cancer. Ba -ba -ba -ba. CR is probably my biggest obstacle here. Also, her bra looks like they're just dragon claws groping her breasts. This game is rated E10, I believe. E, not even E10, it's rated E. Eh, this is gonna be quite the issue here. Considering I think it can hit me pretty well. I was, <laughs> for a second I was like, oh, it can't hit me, never mind. But then I realized that we weren't on anything. Giga Flames! I think you see my concern here. And I gotta fight it again. All right, let's not have that again, shall we? In fact, she won't even get the chance. Oh boy. Smoke breath! Please hit! Phew! Which is why I need to bring Whiskey's uh, speed up to maximum. I got gold. I got gold. That's a lot of gold. Live by, by the vape, die by the vape. Hell yeah! Vape Nish! When did oh he lost fame from the I'm a Fimba meet, right? You were close. All right, what the? I think Wiz Kitty learned a lesson here. Defense is up. That's good. Wiz Kitty says, I want fishbone. No, I'm being sting. And we get our, uh, our thing. Eighth rank. Wiz Kitty seems well. I still haven't gotten any mail regarding a sale. The next tournament's in February, and the one after that is in May. But I'm not sure how well Whisk Kitty will be able to hold up. So you know what I'll do? What sale I'm loaded? That's true. That is very true. Hmm. I just don't want to be lacking money when they do the, the building thing. Although, they don't really seem to cost that much, so... So here's what I'm gonna do. You can use a nuts oil on him, so that way I know he'll be a full strength when I get him uh, when I bring him back in. And now we're going to town. 
There are things to increase monster lifespan, but they're very, very, very hard to come by. Can you emulate this game? Yes, but I don't think emulators allow you to do the disc scanning thing. Alrighty. I just gotta remember at the end of December. I must remember at the end of December. Uh, to... Uh, freeze... Yeah, no, not to, to freeze? Yeah, to freeze, uh... To freeze Beak of Fire. We're gonna bring in, uh... We're gonna bring in, uh, Beak of Fire. Okay, you can emulate the, uh, the disc reading. Okay, that's good. Let's do our best to raise Beak of Fire. Da burb. All right, I just gotta remember. Last day of December, I, first day of January, I have to freeze Cinderburb and bring back Whisk Kitty. So, I'm pretty much gonna have Whisk Kitty be on a strict training session for life, power, and intelligence. Because honestly, this thing is going to be my adventuring, but uh, my adventuring companion. So let's start with the domino. Let's do the drill! Phoenix, I think, is an inherently good monster as well. So I think I, I think it's less prone to cheating in that in that regard. Remember, remember the end of December. Adventure buddy! Beak of fire! My adventure buddy! Yeah, the whole point of the anime was to find the phoenix because uh, the evil dragon Moo was turning monsters into bad monsters. Are there other ways to get monsters other than disc scanning? You could, you can uh, buy basic monsters. Um, in this one, I think it's uh, Zoom, Suezo, Mochi, Arrowhead, Hair, and plants, maybe. Oh shoot, I forgot what food he likes. I gotta guess fish. Yes, he likes fish. You can turn the phoenix evil and it learns a technique from it. Oh, interesting. The phoenix- yeah, the phoenix doesn't actually die. The, when the phoenix uh, is at the end of its lifespan, it'll go away where it'll- it'll actually just leave. Whisk Kitty isn't gone, Whisk Kitty is frozen. Peak of Fire is not prepared to fight. I'll, I'm sorry. Gonna keep going on the domino. Failure? Peak of Fire! We don't have any items. We don't have no items. Alright, this- uh, time for him to rest this week. Uh, let's see. Let's go for life. Have him do the run. Trot, bird, trot! Cheating motherfucker. Fish the tournament's happening this week. Beak of Fire seems to be in good shape for it. Beak of Fire as well. I th I want to say Beak of Fire has enough to actually be able to do good in this. Oh, he likes battle, dislikes meat. Okay, good, so I gave him the right thing on the fish. Ooh! He starts off with Heat Beam! That's a pretty good technique. Inaccurate, but really good. I 
I have to, so here's the thing, I have to get him up to at least B rank before he can actually go on these adventures. On top of that, he has to have a certain amount of fame. He's a vegetarian. No, he eats fish. He likes fish. Boom! boom Oh, we gotta fight against Oakley Man. Oakley Man. It's like Ocean Man. Ocean Man. Can you fuse a dragon with a phoenix? I do not think so. Oh yeah, he's definitely ready for, for D rank. Trying to get those one-two punches in. Nothing compared to that. Aha! The Talons! I'll give you the Talon Trots! Taste my beak of- oh. Taste my beak of fire! Big pecs! ba da 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 Beak of Fire 1! Junamule versus Oakley Man. Hey, Junamule 1! Neat. And Herakix 1, the lovable little dino. The lovable little no licking. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba -ba. Ba ba da ba 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 da ba ba. Heat beam eye blast. Heat beam eye blast. One of the many things I took away from Jackie Chan Adventures. No, get away from me as I hop away. Oh, I could have done an attack there while he was fooling around. Didn't do a lot of damage. Foolery! Oh, he fooleried three times! Oh, I had a chance there! I should get close to him so he can't, like, do stuff out of the blue there. Oh, well, this beak may or may not hit. There we go. Oh, he went bulby on me with the slapping and clapping. Oh, don't you dare! We're not doing this! I think he won. I think he won from that. Name five things that aren't Jackie Chan. Damn it, he has to lose now in order for me to, to win this. Slap, 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 clap, 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 slap, 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 clap, clap, clap. I ain't having any of your ass! If I would just stop pulling around. Heat beams! <laughs> Heat beam! Don't you try to assault me with your tail? Now he's dead. <laughs> muck, luck, luck, yeah, muck, luck, luck, yeah. Ooh, caribou! All right, I really need you to willing to lose the gnats here. And possibly one other monster, because I don't want to fight him again. Damn it! Oh, that was really close, too. Fool around at the beginning. Fool around, shame on you. Fool around again, shame on me, because I'm a bad trainer then. Yes! I can just kind of sit around now, because none of his attacks can even come close to that amount of damage. Get away! Away with you! Away with you. 
I said away, good sir. I said... I said... I'm asking you politely... To step off! He did! Please lose to whoever you're fighting against, Lontar. Possibly Lontar. I can I believe in you, Lontar! Yes! I have a chance! Never mind, I gotta fight Oakley Man now. Heretic. 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 He's got no intelligence, but quite a bit of speed. I think I can keep up with him, though. Yeah, I can keep up with him just fine. Heat beams! Oh, I actually hit him with that. Uh, things I wasn't expecting. Table for one. Oh, no. Oh, no! Woo! Straight. One of his most devastating attacks. Would you cut that out? Will you cut that out? Oh, not the foolery. Not the straight! I'm getting greedy. I'm getting greedy. I'm mad enough to admit it. Talons! Talons! T -t -t Talons! Hey, I beat Oakley Man. That's a rarity. Almost never beat Oakley Man. All right. If Junamule loses to Hera Kicks, then I don't have to fight him again. Yes! I have claimed the belt for me. Was I gonna let the old the, the old cat die? Yes, I am gonna let the old cat die, but not until he actually goes and participates in the uh, the upcoming tournament. All right, very important. I have to go get uh, Whisk Kitty now. So that way the invite to the tournament stands. All right, go wow, he gained a ton of fame from that. First tourney wins. I gotta make sure his uh, his fame is up as well, on top of his health and whatnot. My biggest problem though is if we happen to encounter a monster while we're uh, on there, because you can do that. There are some monsters that you can you can encounter on uh, on uh, expeditions. Which food do you want to give him this month? We'll give him fish since he likes it so much. Although he's a baby, so let me give him milk. There we go, cheaper alternative. Gave him the trots! Is it January? Yes, it is. Beak of Fire seems well. To the town! We're going to town, aren't we? Yes. 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 To the lab, Bingo! Goddard! Bingo! Gamer Unit Zero! Thank you for joining the elite members of the Tommy's Party. Enjoy your tinted glass in your emotes. Here is a sub for your sub. Mwah. Yes. Yes. But it's a bird. Why does it need milk? Because it's a baby. That's all the reason you need. I remember, like, when I did, uh, when I had Roboclop, like, way, way back, like, uh, when we pretty much finished the series, and it was like, oh, well, Roboclop's what we're gonna beat this with, and I'm surprised he didn't die immediately after that tournament. Alright, he could use this day to train, actually. Uh, I still want to get that speed up, so let's have him do the leap. <laughs> do, 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 do. 
Everything likes milk! Damn it! I'm not gonna scold him because he'll get stressed, and him getting stressed is the last thing I need right now. Who is it? There we go, there's the invite to the tournament. The greatest four. This kitty is well. All right, let's give him a mint leaf. I don't have any items. Let's go shopping for a mint leaf. Bye. Mint leaf. Use mint leaf. Freeze this kitty again? Yes. I'm gonna freeze him until the day of the tournament. That'll give him... Oh, I'll freeze him until the day before the tournament. So I can at least have him train, and then I can give him a nuts oil, so he'll be in, in peak condition for it. I've calculated this out. That's... That ain't stinking thinking right there. Whisk Kitty's final battle. His final battle is, isn't this one. It's the, it's the one after it. How can I help you? Are you sure you want to freeze this monster? It's frozen. Beak of fire, beak of fire, beak of beak of fire, beak of beak, 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 beak of beak of fire, beak of 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 fire, beak of fire, beak of fire, got him, now let's go back to the red so we can finally train. Train him up, knock him down. Uh, he needs, he needs to rest. Let's see, he needs the domino. Domino rally set! Yeah! You can fire as well. When is this tournament? It's next, it's uh... All right, so train him, uh, train him for one more day and then replace him tomorrow, okay. Got it! Didn't work! Let's have him study. I want to see my bird in a, uh, in a, in a classroom. Bird learning from another bird! Apparently the toucan's immortal, too. Yeah, I understood it! Suck off! Which food do you want to give him this month? Fish! Bum, bum. I might... Mm. Seems well. It's time to go to town. I think I'm gonna let Whisk Kitty rest before the tournament then. <laughs> I don't mean to alarm you, but your chicken is on fire. Ah, it's your cash! Two dollars from uh, Forgotten Assassin saying, Hey Tom, remember this? It's Tom Trio. Yeah, I remember Tom Trio. Toucan is the reason why you can only give a, a give uh only, the reason why you can only give one golden peach per monster, huh? Freeze. Or maybe it can live longer, not being constantly trained and put uh, to fight against other monsters. Are you talking about the bird? Or are you talking about Whisk Kitty? Be 
Because... Whisk Kitty, I'm only bringing out two fight monsters, because he's... He's almost... He's the, the first mo First of all, he's the first monster I've raised. Second... Uh... Oh, it was a joke, okay. Maybe I could live longer, but... I well, the bird I need to get up to B rank in order to be able to use him in, uh, uh, expeditions. And Whisk Kitty, I'm only bringing out two fight. Time to let him rest so he can rest right now. Oh, they're talking about the toucan, okay. I do it all for the toucan. The what? The toucan. The what? The toucan. See, you can take the toucan and sh shove it up your way, yeah? Save file number nine. Terrain? No, battle. In the greatest four. As we take our steps from here to the rest of our life, to the rest of Whisk Kitty's life, anyway. Greatest four. It's now winter here in the Torbola re region. Under this circumstance, Greatest Four is about to start. What the? Let's go for it. Zelandia, he was pretty easy. Carmine, oh boy. And Loveless. I don't know what Loveless is. I, d I haven't seen that, that, uh, monster, like, thumbnail before. Zelandia is no problem, though. Zelandia, I don't think he can even. T oh, okay, he can touch me, just not very well. Not with Inferno, anyway. Oh, for God's sake. What do you want me to do? Dress a dragon, do the hula? Blow ow! Oakley Man, the true final. Oh, why did he get Gert? Of all things from to God, he get he got Gert. Well, I just gotta hit him once, so there we go. I know it's grit, but I like saying it is Gert. Get Gert. <laughs> Loveless. What's Loveless? Oh, Loveless is a Durahan. Okay. Oh, we should be no problem then. Durahan specialized in power and defense. <laughs> Two damage? That's overkill! 50% overkill! Yeah, the problem is me avoiding his stuff, like his death energy right off the bat! Oh my god! Twister Claw! Not Thrust Claw! No, not Bubble Shield! Get away! God, goodness sake. Okay! Whew. Bubba. <laughs> Robots can't walk. <clears throat> Damn it! Robots. I can't do it. I can't do it right now. The faces of the moon aren't right. I have no idea why I can't do the robot voice correctly. I don't know why. <clears throat> Moisture, maybe? Maybe if I drink water, I'd be able to do it better. Hello. I'm going to kill this Duran. Duran, by the way, being one of the parts of Roboclop. The other part being a centaur. Yeah, he, Okay, he's not gonna dodge me at the very least. He can hit me pretty well, though. Wow! Wow, he can hit me pretty well! This is going to be an interesting fight. Dang! 
push you back here. Uh oh! Phew! Didn't want that blood on my hands. Ooh, I think I got him! Yes! Thank God he didn't have Gert. Bum, 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 bum. No, I don't think hit percent's bullshit there. It was a 50% chance for him to hit. Ooh, if I had lost him, I'd have to fight him again. Eesh. Da, 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 da. Give us your cash! 260 from Dan Jess saying, if you're hungry for a hunk of fat and juicy meat, eat my buddy Pumba here because he, ha he has a treat. Coming down and dying on the stage swine, all I have to do is get in line. Ah, you aching! Yup, yup, yup. Faw, some bacon! He's a big pig! You can be a big pig too! Oi! That's literally the entire donation right there from Dan Genesis. What was that? That was the uh that was the point in the Lion King where uh where uh Timon and Pumba were being live bait to lure the hyenas away from uh from Scar. It's a really good scene. I love that scene so much. I will praise the Whiskey. Whiskey says, I want fishbone. Yeah, let's try and de-stress him as much as possible, even if it means spoiling him a little bit. Yes, who is it? Here we go! I'm rank nine, baby. I love the uh, the animations people have done, where it's like, uh, uh, you know, I'll use a mint leaf on him for now, and the next time I have him out, I'll let him rest. All right, so the next invite I get will be in April. Second week of April. <laughs> yep, second week of April, so I gotta remember to have, to put, uh, Cinderburb, uh, in stasis. Uh, in order to get Whisk Kitty back out for the invite. Alright! We're going to town! <laughs> Timon's Jewish mother. To be fair, <laughs> Nathan Lane sounds pretty Jewish as it is, so. I do <laughs> I do love that one line of the producers, though. There's two rules of producing. First rule, never use your own money. What's the second rule? NEVER USE YOUR OWN MONEY! Why would I need to, need to approve of an emote? Remember, remember, the first week of April. Doesn't roll off the tongue very well. Is he being put on ice or on the back burner? Uh, technically the back burner because we're bringing him out regularly. Regularly. Uh, I think... Oh, I gotta let him rest this week. I think they just were, were couldn't be bothered to come up with a freezing pose for him, so they just left him in T pose. I think I did this with, with Roboclop, too, when he was at the end of his days. Springtime for Cinderburb. Come eat a fish. 
winter for Poland and France. The official tournament's at the end of this month. You want to prepare Beak of Fire to fight? Beak of Fire is well. He's getting swathed on me. Welcome. Uh, yada yada yada. Really? Okay, then. What are you going to do today? I'm going to buy... Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Three, four, five, six, seven. And then I use one of the mint leaves and I buy another one. I learned that that technique in Call of Duty. Kind of funny because I just saw Drew go online playing uh, Worms Ultimate Mayhem, which is what that Call of Doodle joke was from. Scrock! Scrock! Uh, let's have him go for a run. Get, become a fat burb! And he's also being a cheater! Scold it? Yes. It seems sorry. Uh, sec uh, first week of April, right. Do the domino! Do the domino! Swing your arms from side to side! He failed. Scold him a little bit. Seems well. Time for him to rest. He's becoming a borb. He's not in good shape for it. However, the the rigorous training I'm going to put him through. Oh, the rigorous training of. Dominoes. Dominoes! You did it, Beakley! You win! You win! And I will give him milk! And alrighty, guys! It is time! For us to go on break. Once we get back, let me just give him a mint leaf first before anything else. When we get back from the break, or if you're watching this on YouTube when we come back tomorrow, or if you're watching this on YouTube well after it's been posted, once you click on the next video, uh, we're gonna be having Whisk Kitty fight in that final tournament. That final tournament, and once that's over with, we're gonna go ahead and have Cinderburb uh, be trained up to go on expeditions. So. I will see you all then. Later.